So why am I still vegan? Hmm. I think a much better question is why the fuck are you not? <laughs> Oops, I said the F word, am I allowed to say that? It is my video, so I can do whatever I want. Um, so yeah, uh, why are you not vegan? And I grew up in a culture that propagated meat and animal products and byproducts as something that you must ingest in order to be able to survive. Um, and I grew up not questioning that reality, that was a reality for me. So once my eyes opened up, these beautiful, gorgeous blue eyes, they can never be closed again. Uh, and I'm really hoping to spread that message to everybody else out there. Once you see the injustice that us as humans, AKA devils, do to the poor animals and the environment, um, you cannot go back to your old way of living because, <laughs> because we are literally destroying everything around us. So why am I still a vegan? I am still a vegan because I, love animals and loving animals does not mean stuffing them in your face uh hashtag but bacon really it is not oxygen you can survive it is a poor body of a tortured murdered animal that you're now frying and stuffing in your face so um definitely not a must-have item in your mouth okay let's just be real there <laughs> um because I love the animals and I don't eat them, I don't wear them, and I don't use them for entertainment. So no, a fox is not a freaking fashion item. A fox is a living being that deserves to live as much as you and I do, okay? And an elephant is another living being that deserves to be left alone, to live out its own life in a way that it wants to, and not to be forced um, to perform stupid tricks for you and for your amusement or to carry you on its back. I am still vegan because I love the environment. I want to see the lungs of our planet, the Amazon, to thrive, to grow, and not to be continuously deforested on a daily basis. We are doing this to our planet. How many times do you see on Facebook, and I know that majority of us get our news from Facebook nowadays, right? Because it's on the internet and we all know <laughs> that's where all the wisdom comes from, right? But um, how many times do you see a video or a picture or, or a meme that pops up on Facebook about a new um, last of the species dies today, right? I mean, it happens all the time. How many species are we going to drive to extinction before we freaking wake up and realize that the resources on this planet are finite. We literally cannot continue to live and to eat and to consume in the same rate that we have been um, in the last hundred years especially and sustain it. It is not a sustainable model. We are reproducing at too high of a rate and we are over consuming and destroying everything in our path. So I am still vegan because I want our future generation to have a planet to live on as well. We're focusing too much on, you know, uh, sending uh, ships out to Mars, which is great. It's a great scientific advancement, but how about focusing on a planet that we actually do have right now, currently, that gives us life and saving that one? How about that for a grand idea? And you can help by going vegan. I mean, it's as simple as that. I just did a calculation yesterday uh, on how many animal lives have I saved so far just by being vegan for seven years. And it told me that I saved over 2,500 animals. I single-handedly saved over 2,500 animals in the seven years of being vegan. Plus on top of that, I have been vegetarian for eight years prior to that. So can you imagine? And when somebody tells me that one person cannot make a difference, I dare to disagree because one person can make all the difference. And one person who goes against the norm can actually change the course in which the whole culture shifts. And that's what I wanna see. I want to create a world where people actually give a damn about the animals, about the environment, about our planet, about our future generations, and about ourselves. I want to live in a world where people care. Even though I've come from a culture where meat and animal products and byproducts are used 
and overused and, and horribly used on a daily basis. Um, I have gone completely against what my culture stands for and I am proud and I celebrate who I am, the new me, every day because I fight for what's right. Every life is precious. So if you say that you love animals, please don't stuff them in your face tonight. So what really helped me kind of um, uh, think about uh, turning vegan was I walked into my sister's room and she had a poster where there was a um, little piglet and a puppy and it said how do you choose which one is your friend and which one is your food and that hit me really really deeply think about it you're conditioned by your culture to tell you that the piglet is food yet puppy is your best friend so why is one life better than the other Yet we know that pigs have the intellect level of three-year-olds. That is scary. So um, I feel like it's time for us to get in touch with our inner self, with the person who actually loves and cares and has compassion and turn that into your life's story and turn that into your lifestyle and go vegan. So why am I still vegan? Because I believe that better times are ahead and I believe for standing up for what's right and I believe for fighting for the rights of animals, for the environment and for our planet and for the human population as a whole. So if you believe the same, if you haven't done it yet, go vegan. <laughs> um, that is the single best thing you can do uh, to, to ensure the preservation and the survival of this beautiful blue ball that we live, live on called earth i love the blue ball just the one because who knows where we might find another one right <laughs> thank you so much you guys for watching please let me know in the comment box below what are your thoughts on this topic um, has there been a particular instance in your life that made you switch see that light bulb and change the way you're living or um, if there have been any uh, trials tribulations or successes from some of the stuff that you've seen along your journey and if you're not vegan already please let me know why um, and hopefully I can inspire you to change your mind and maybe you can take my free one week vegan challenge and see how you like it for a week and then hopefully stick to it so you guys thank you so much for watching stay strong on your vegan voyage yes and I will see all of you in the next video Mwah. Love you mucho.